Elvis. Billy is in debt. This is debt. See, Billy just got out of college and had a student loan debt, just like many other Americans, owing around $30,000. Billy should probably be careful with his money so he can pay off his debt as quickly as possible. Oh wait, you can buy anything from the credit card. But wait, Billy, all this stuff still costs money. Don't listen to that. You're just racking up more debt. Don't you know that, Billy? Whenever you use that credit card, you owe more and more money. Owing money is the definition of debt, Billy. Don't tell him that. See, listen here, Billy. Your debt is getting stronger and trying to take over your life. What's even worse is that the extra money you owe is an in interest. And if you don't pay back what you spent, and the added interest, people will notice that, and they will never let you buy things from them again. You won't be able to buy a house or a car with that kind of reputation. Is that what you want, Billy? Don't worry, Billy. I'm gonna teach you a thing or two about debt. Well, it's sad to say you aren't alone, Billy. The average credit card debt is $15,000. Hey, I'm pretty good at my job. You sure are, debt. You even have control over our world's government. Billy's debt is what we call consumer debt, but public debt is how much debt the government owes. And guess what, Billy? They have you beat at $18.4 trillion and rising. In fact, the government has the highest debt in the world in pure money. Although, when you compare it to the money we make, Japan has the highest amount of debt. It's not too bad for me. Debt can really screw up the economy. If it causes a recession when people are more focused on paying off their debt than investing in the economy itself. Now, Billy, do you see how bad debt is? Are you even paying attention, Billy? What are you doing over there? But remember, Billy, personal debt can be a good thing if you use it for an investment. For instance, go out there and get a good job with that college degree you earned. Pay off college with a credit card. Aw, uh, come off it, debt. Poor Billy here doesn't need that. You can still screw over the government. For now, let's go back in time where debt and Billy can make a deal. Debt, Billy will pay you back using the money he makes from the college investment. Billy, debt will stop taking over the rest of your life. See, even debt can be a nice guy once in a while.